Alright, Nick, uh, you guys are undefeated on the day. Yes, sir. Okay. I just saw, okay, you got to clear some stuff up. I just asked you, are you wrestling next year in high school? Uh, I am. I'm going to finish it off next year. Well, I'll be, I'll stay home for football season, homeschool and play football after, and then after football season, I'm going to go to Colorado to wrestle. I'm going to have it set up to where I can still uh, wrestle for Riverdale High School and become a three-timer. Okay, when you look at the decision to kind of do the in-between between Colorado Springs and Tennessee, you know, what plays into that? What factors into that? They don't have a head coach set up yet, you know, as far as who's going to replace Coach Burnett. Um, does, that, does that factor in it? Who do you talk to? Who influences you in this whole decision? For the OTC? Yeah. Uh, the, uh, uh, Matt Lillian. He's a, he's a, I think he's... He's the head Greco coach. He is the head Greco coach. He's he's the one that's been wanting me to get out there, and he loves the way I wrestle, and he sees stuff in me that he hasn't seen in a while. So this is a Greco-driven thing completely? Yes, sir. Looking at our Greco ladder right now, Robbie Smith, he's the top yeah. guy. Is it something where you're just going to concentrate more on the junior level? What do you look at? University level? Uh, what do you look at? Uh, you know, uh, Competing in both, really, but um, that's what they have one do right now. He's competing junior and senior level, and he's he's good. He's he won. He got third at World Team Trials, and he's only 18 years old. So that's what I'll be doing, just like him, is competing in both senior level and junior level. So you're gonna split between the two? Yes, sir. I mean, it'll be. It's, yeah, yeah. It's like cadet wrestling juniors, but a lot better. Just wrestling up. Yeah. yeah. Looking at you know how how our OTC program is. Colorado Springs. How many times have you been out here previous to making this decision? Uh, to OTC? Yeah. I've only been once, but I loved it ever since. I stayed there for a week, and it's just fun there. Well, there's only like two hard days out of the whole week, and the other days are just technique and the training, the food, everything's good there. It's just like college, but no school. <laughs> <laughs> Look at it. Speaking of college, you're going to Chattanooga, right? No, sir. I'm you're, not, we're, I'm, we're, you're not committed I'm not, yet? I have I'll, I'm going to take a break off from school for a while. So, so you might just go the route of like how some like what Henry Cejudo did, what mm -hmm. what uh, you know, looking at uh, Aaron Pico, what he yeah. did. You might go that route. Uh, it depends if I like it. I'm gonna stay for a couple of extra years, and cause I, my eligibility will still be there. And if, if I want to wrestle college, I'll probably my top choices are probably like UTC, uh, Virginia, and. Uh, Naval Academy. So you're a pretty good student. I mean, you, when you say the Naval Academy and UVA and UTC, those are pretty good schools. Yes, sir. Uh, academics, how important is that? Well, it's very important. That's, what, that's the first thing college is asked. So. Looking at this dual meet series today, you guys have you've smoked everybody I've seen you wrestle. Yeah. Do you like that rolling tally, how the, the match score factors into that? Do you like it at all? I haven't really. I mean, if it was a close match, I have to see how it works. But you right score a lot of points. Yeah, right now I'm liking it because it's, it's either a blowout or, or you're getting blown out. You're from Nashville? Uh, Murfreesboro. How far is from Nashville? 30 minutes. So, so it's Nashville, essentially. Yeah. Yeah. Looking at, you know, kind of wrestling in Tennessee, it's it's getting there. Yeah, you, know, you guys is. have had some NCAA champs, you know. But looking at that, what's a, you want, is this somewhere where you want to live, coach here? What do you want to do? I, would, I love Tennessee. I'd love to live here. What I'm looking for is to maybe start up my own like freestyle and Greco because you don't see many of those. Uh, Coach Welder is starting one and it's getting bigger as the, the weeks go. But I want to start a program that in Tennessee because it gets you great. Like compound wrestling, that's what I kind of want to be in Tennessee. It would be a good feeder program for all these colleges and stuff. That's what we don't have for like, like – Compound, that's why they're always great because they have good coaches and stuff. And they don't really teach freestyle and Greco, so that's what they're doing. Looking at, you know, football, you're going to play high school football next year. Is football off the table? You seem to love wrestling. Is football off the table? Uh, college, college football. College football, I wish I got the height. I didn't get the height of my family. You got oh, six foot, wait. six foot tall? Yeah, all the coaches look for a 6'2", 6'3", defense alignment, and it just didn't get to me. I mean, I would love to play football because that's where the money's at, but it is what it is. You love wrestling? I love both. It's, it's really, I've done both of them since I was wrestling since I was in, since I was four and uh, football since I was in second grade, so it's always been with me. UTC says, we will let you play football. And I actually had a coach come talk to me the other day about football. Would you do it? 
Uh, maybe a bigger school. Bigger school? <laughs> yes, sir. I can, see, I, mean, I can see that on your neck right now. <laughs> Volunteers yeah, come calling. Would you go do it? I, I visited my sophomore year, and the height didn't. They measured me at 5'9". And, really? Yeah. You're not 5'9". Well, no, that, that's, that was the weird part about it. Is I, I didn't think I was 5'9". <laughs> at all. <laughs> And they said that, and I'm like, all right, I guess I can't play. <laughs> Unless I, I got to be a walk-on. Uh, no, no thanks. You don't love football that much? Well, I do, but it's the money. The money? Yeah. Yeah. All right, you got anything else for me? No, sir. Hey, thanks for the time. Good luck. Thank you.